I'm Caitlin Bailey with Satellite Beach Recreation, and today we are going to be doing some fun cranberry experiments to see what kind of structures are the strongest. After reading Bear Gives Thanks by Carmel Wilson, you have seen how all of the animals in that forest come together to bring Bear food, and he gives thanks to all of these animals. Bear is so grateful to all of his other animal friends that they bring so much food for them all to share. Thanksgiving is a holiday full of giving thanks and being grateful for what we have. So in today's holiday spirit, let's add some fun to this wonderful holiday. To make our cranberry structures, we are going to need a bag of cranberries, some toothpicks, and a weight so we can test how good our structures are. Today our structures may look like a box, a triangle, or some other type of shape. Before we start our test, get out a sheet of paper and write down what you think the test will do. Will each shape that you make fail or succeed in your weight test? To build these structures, we will be placing cranberries on either side of a toothpick. Just like this. We will be using our toothpicks and our cranberries to build structures like these or structures in our imagination. To test to see if these structures are sturdy enough, we will be using a three pound weight to put on top of our structures and see if they can withstand it. This is test one. Okay. The tradition of Thanksgiving started when the pilgrims who settled in Plymouth, they first had a celebration of a harvest in 1621. The feast was organized by Governor Willem Bradford, who also invented the local Wanampog Indians to join with their meal. The first time they called the feast Thanksgiving was in 1623, after rain had ended a long drought. The first national Thanksgiving Day was proclaimed by President George Washington in 1789. However, it did not become a regular holiday in the United States until 1863, when Abraham Lincoln declared that the last Thursday in November should be celebrated as Thanksgiving. Since then, it has been celebrated every single year in the United States. The day was made official a federal holiday and moved to the fourth Thursday of November in 1941 by President Franklin Roosevelt. Every year, a live turkey is presented to the President of the United States, who then pardons this turkey, and it gets to live out in the life on a farm. From this experiment, you can tell that all five of these structures were our strongest. These three were not as strong and crushed under the three pound of weight. Do you think that these five structures can hold more than three pounds? For the next test, I'm going to be testing these five structures with a five pound weight. Set two, test one. Around 46 million turkeys are eaten every year in the US on Thanksgiving in 2010. It was around fifth of all the turkeys eaten in the entire year. Benjamin Franklin wanted the turkey to be the national bird instead of the bald eagle. Around 88% of Americans eat turkey on Thanksgiving. The pilgrims sailed to America from Great Britain on a ship called the Mayflower. The day after Thanksgiving is called Black Friday. It is the biggest shopping day of the year. This was the best 
structure I made today. These four structures could hold three pounds, but not five. Still very good structures. Please share with us at Play Saddle and Beach. What do you think before this Thanksgiving? Thank you so much for joining with me today at Play Satellite Beach in partnership of the Satellite Beach Library. To recreate this project, please check the links below for more information. Have a wonderful day and remember to get ready for Thanksgiving because family is important on this important holiday.